This ain't nice, I know. <laughs> Not a bad day of robbing the establishment to give to the poor, eh, Mr. Marston? Very noble, I'm sure, but I need to know where Williamson and Escuela are holed up. All in good time, amigo. I'm off to deliver these goods. I'll see you back at the ranch. Oh. My spies tell me they soon will have the information you need. Say, partner.
I'd see you again. Mr. Tollitz, I've got your money. Oh, thank you, sir. Thank you. I damn well knew you were the kind of chap to be trusted. A fine fellow, sir. Fine fellow indeed. Unlikely to run off and report me to the authorities, what? <laughs> report what, Tollitz? Well, the Dagos here don't appreciate the terrible needs we answer. Now, building a country's hard, sir. It's hard. I hope opium's nasty business, but it's necessary. Necessary. Opium? Well, you mean you didn't even sneak a taste of that package? <laughs> Are you mad, sir? That's fine stuff. Straight from Ongo Bongo land uh, somewhere. <laughs> you use me. Well, are you a moralist or just a fool? Both, I guess. We provide a much-needed service for the railroad workers. We help ease the pain and loneliness, them being so far away from home and all that. <laughs> but there's nothing wrong with this. I've smoked it myself for years. Here. I don't want nothing to do with it. Well, I thank you. Here's hoping we can do business again in the future. Beats dealing with the bloody savages. Is there something else I can do for you? We'll be off then. Making the place look untidy. Thanks. Que tenga usted un día emocionante. He couldn't hit a barn door with a dog. Nonsense. Dirt, howdy. 
I'm hauling out tomorrow. I'm gonna start this up. weather we have in. Llamada final, last call, all aboard.
Let's go! Fama, my girl is 
grande. Sáltame. Come with me. Sí, pues, cabrón. A ver si te pego en el culo. Salvador, happy you did my work, gringo. Gracias.
पूरे से That wretched animal that Santa has been sent to oversee a massacre in El Sepulco. Come, we must stop him and finally kill that vermin and all of Allende's other followers. Hurry, I don't know how much time we have. Mount your horse and get after them. Good luck. Come on. That is also true. Well, now I hope you will have your revenge. I need him alive. He's got information on the men I'm looking for. And when you have the information? Then he's all yours. It is good that you are helping Luisa. It ain't right what happened to her father. She's a brave girl. She can fight as well as any man. She ain't the only woman I've seen fighting for Reyes. El Sepulcro is just up ahead. All right. Tell your men not to open fire till I make a move. We don't want to give them a chance to escape. And leave DeSanta to me. I need him alive. We will wait for your lead, señor. En el nombre del gobierno provincial del coronel Allende y del estado de este país, te condeno a muerte por traición. ¿Tienes algunas últimas palabras? No. Come on, quick. Dame un poco de espacio, amigo. Understand that. Think about what you are doing. If you kill me, you have the entire Mexican army after you. Come to an agreement. Yata! My men will kill you. Where 
is Javier Escuela. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, wait, wait. Okay. All right. All right. Shit. All right. Casa Madrugada. It's hold up there. Now hurry up and kill me. Or just let me go. Okay? Can we kill this piece of shit now, senor? Or would you like to pleasure yourself? Please! I am begging you! What are you waiting for? He's all yours, fellas. I got what I need. Esto es para Mexico! It is done. Come on, now we find your friend. Are you crazy? We cannot stop now. If it ain't me, it's someone else. Come on! You can't give up now. Thank you, compadre. It should really have been you. I don't like to kill a man on his knees, even if he does deserve it. That man is responsible for hundreds of innocent dead, maybe thousands. He will burn in hell. We all will, my friend. Espinosa is dead. De Santa is dead. The army is without leaders. We must move on and get there now before it's too late. First, you need to help me find Javier Escuela. Let's go. Deserted. Is it always this quiet? Ahora mismo! Hey, you, lady. Hmm. Where's Javier Escuela? <laughs> Javier Escuela? He hasn't been seen around here in months. You shot up this place for him, huh? I wouldn't spit on him if he was on fire. I don't blame you. But Captain DeSanta said he was here. <laughs> and you believe him? You must be more stupid than you look. <laughs> Go shoot up some place else. <coughs> <laughs>
Te ve la próxima vez que sea un poco más durito, ¿eh? <laughs> And I mean rougher, ¿eh? <laughs> What would your most loyal follower, Luisa, say about that? Uh, who? Luisa, the girl from Campo Morada. Uh, her, I, a gentleman never tells, but she was a most wonderful... Uh, I just say she was increíble. Yes. Let me tell you something. I strongly recommend her. You take her when you have the chance, my brother. <laughs> she thinks she's your wife. My wife? These peasant girls, they believe every word a fellow says. So naive. It's really quite charming. I love peasants. No, you love peasants? I love them. They have such purity. Are you gonna marry her? Ha! Marry a peasant? My dear boy, don't be absurd. I'm going to be the next president of Mexico. My wife will meet ambassadors, kings, other great men, the very thought that I would marry some peasant girl with a tight gun and the hands of a farmer. Well, I really don't think so. My mother, que Dios la cuide, would turn in her grave. Interesting. Mm -hmm. But come on, let's run. I've got an amazing present for you, my brother, huh? Yes, the man you seek. Together, we will bring them to justice. Let's go. <laughs> Come on, mi hermano. This is the day we have both been waiting for. Bien, vamos, hermanos. My brother, I just received word of your fight with Allende's men at El Sepulcro. Finally, the Santa is dead. But well, why did... My men will launch a ruse attack on the side entrance to the fort. Meanwhile, you, my American friend, will drive this wagon at the front gate and jump off when you're close. It's been packed with five crates of TNT. That sounds crazy. How long's the fuse? <laughs> yes, like I say, fun times. It's plenty long enough, I think. I see you in there, amigo. Remember to jump, my friend.
I know you're here, old friend. Hello, old friend. It's been a long time. <laughs> Hello, brother. It's uh, good to see you. I heard you was coming. You took your time, no? Come on, you're not gonna shoot your own brother, are you? We was family. Yeah, we were. Then you and Dutch went crazy and family didn't mean so much. <laughs> so now you do the government's work. And what do you do? You just work for a different government. <laughs> Come on, brother. I think we should go our separate ways, huh? What you and Dutch did was wrong. And the way you left me was wrong. Now, I hate to judge, but as it turns out, it's you or me. The way I see it, might as well be you. We thought you was dead, brother. I promise. I'm telling the truth. Besides, I can give you Bill. In Dutch, Dutch is in Colombia. I can take you straight to him. Hmm? If you left me to die, Whoa. To save your own skin. And now, <laughs> you expect me to care whoa, about whoa, you? you got it all wrong, brother. I've always loved you. Even now. You never won. You got it this, John. It's over, old friend. I got you now. I'm taking you in, my brother. I'll let the others judge it. Where's Bill? I don't Where's know. Where's Bill, you son of a bitch? Do you think I won't kill you, brother? He ain't here, brother. He's with a gender. It's a little late for revenge, John. I ain't here to kill you, Javier. This is just business. Come on, amigo. Abigail wouldn't want this. Abigail would have killed you already. She always thought you was a creep. You're gonna be locked up for a hell of a long time. Unless they choose to hang you. Finally, you have what you came for, my friend. Family, brother. Oh, you and me. Like Cain and Abel, I guess. Leaving each other for dead. Oh, you shit. Don't be sure about what you're doing, brother. You saw me out. Didn't that life we had mean nothing to you? Oh, ah, oh, you puto. Oh, one day, one day I promise you, you're gonna regret this. One day's about all you got left. I hope you and your wife and children rot in hell. You know, that life we lived is over. And when we was living it, it didn't mean nothing anyway. It was just an excuse, and we all knew. What I knew is that you was always a puto. And you're still a puto. Marston, come with me. The army sent reinforcements. Come. Yeah, go with your puto. Oh, 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 oh. We have See, to give me. Board, dog. Use one of the cannons. For
two old friends reunited. It is a beautiful thing. Mr. Marston, fancy seeing you down here. I must say it's a pleasant surprise to see you. You've done well, Mr. Marston. Now, Javier here gets to see how far the hand of justice can reach. <laughs> Come on, you. Get in the damn automobile. Can we assume one of my commitments is cleared? Unfortunately, nothing is cleared, John, until your obligations are met. We need you to find Williamson, then head to Blackwater as quick as you can. We have reason to believe that Dutch Vanderland is in the area. Oh, your wife sends her regards. <laughs> Okay, let this man go. And who are you, gringo? I'm no one. But unless you want this town to tear you and your boys to shreds, I suggest you let him go. And you think you could tell me what to do, friend? Oh, you should listen to him, friend. Look at that. You want to risk it? <laughs> the American is a drunk. 
If I were you, I would, I would pull that trigger. Put the gun down, Americano. Ya, ya, mátalo. Dejen mi hombre. Mierda. Ay, Dios mío. Puta Santa Maria. So you want to settle this now, friend? Or you want me to shoot you in the head right now for that poor girl? Okay, but we fight like men, not like dogs. Ugh.